Good morning, Doxology. We worship the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Hail to the Church, the house of the angels. Hail to the Virgin who gave birth to our Savior. Hail to Gabriel who announced to her the good news. Hail to Michael the Archangel. Hail to the twenty-four presbyters. Hail to the cherubim. Hail to the seraphim. Hail to all the hosts of the heavens. Hail to John the Great, forerunner. Hail to the twelve apostles. Hail to our father, Mark the Evangelist, the destroyer of the idols. Hail to Stephen the first martyr. Hail to George the morning star. Hail to the whole choir of the martyrs. Hail to Av Antony and the three of Macari. Hail to the whole choir of the crossbearers. Hail to all the saints who have pleased the Lord through their prayers. O oh, Christ our King, have mercy upon us in your kingdom. O oh, true light that gives light to every man that comes into the world. You came into the world through your love for men and all the creation rejoiced at your coming. You have saved Adam from seduction and delivered Eve from the pangs of death. You gave unto us the spirit of sonship. We praise and bless you with your angels. When the morning hour comes upon us, O Christ our God, the true light, let the thought of light shine within us, and do not let the darkness of pain cover us, that we may praise you with understanding, proclaiming and saying with David, My eyes have reached the morning watch, that I might meditate upon all your words. Hear our word voices according to your great mercy. Save us, O Lord our God, according to your compassion. O caring God, the maker of all good things, who governs well with his chosen ones, the strong governor for those who take refuge in him, who longs for the salvation and deliverance of everyone. Through your goodness that provided for us the night, grant us to pass this day without sin, that we may be worthy to lift up our hands before you without anger or evil thought. At this dawn make straight our coming in, and our going out in the joy of your protection, that we may proclaim your righteousness daily, and praise your power with David the prophet, saying in your peace, O Christ our Savior, we slept and arose, for we have hoped in you. Behold how beneficent and how Pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity, united in the true evangelic love, like the apostles. 
It is like the fragrant oil on the head of Christ Running down the beard, down to the feet That anoints every day The elders, the children and young men And the deacons Those whom the Holy Spirit has attuned Together as a string instrument Always blessing God By psalms and hymns and spiritual songs By day and by night With an incessant heart You are the mother of light The honored mother of God You have carried the uncircumscript logos After you gave birth to him You remained a virgin With praises and blessings We magnify you For of his own will and the pleasure of his Father And the Holy Spirit, he came and saved us And we too hope to win mercy through your intercession With the lover of mankind The select incense of your virginity Ascended to the throne of the Father Better than the incense of the cherubim and the seraphim over Jin Mary. Hail to the new heaven whom the Father has created and made a place of rest for his beloved Son. Hail to the royal throne of him who is carried by the cherubim. Hail to the Advocate of our souls, you are indeed the pride of our race. Intercede on our behalf, O full of grace, before our Savior, our Lord Jesus Christ, that he may confirm us in the upright faith and grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Through the intercessions of the Mother of God, St. Mary, O Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Thousands of thousands and myriads of myriads of archangels and holy angels, they stand before the a throne of the Pantocrator, proclaiming and saying, Holy, holy, holy in truth, the glory and the honor befit the Trinity. Through the intercessions of the whole choir of the angels, O Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Our fathers, the apostles, preached unto the nations the gospel of Jesus Christ. Their voices went forth into all the earth, and their words have reached the ends of the world. Through the prayers of my fathers, the apostles, O Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Unfading crowns the Lord has placed upon the whole choir of the martyrs. He saved and delivered them because they took refuge in him. They celebrated with him in his kingdom. Through the prayers of the whole choir of the martyrs, O Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Your saints bless you, and they speak of the glory of your kingdom. Your kingdom, O my God, is an eternal kingdom, and your lordship is unto all ages. Through the prayers of the whole choir of the cross bearers, the righteous and the just, O Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Hail to Elijah, the prophet of temperance, and Elisha, his elect disciple, the great, the great, disciple, the great evangelist of the land of Egypt. Mark the apostle 
the first prelate. You are the mother of God, O Virgin Mary. Ask him on our behalf to have mercy upon our race. The great patriarch, our father of a severus, whose holy teachings enlightened our minds. Our father, the confessor of a Dioscorus, defended the faith against the heretics. And all of our fathers who have pleased the Lord, may their holy blessings be a guard unto us. Through their prayers, O God, grant us the forgiveness of our sins and give us peace. Your mercies, O my God, are countless and exceedingly plenteous is your compassion. All the raindrops are counted by you and the sand of the sea are before your eyes. How much more are the sins of my soul manifest before you, O my God. The sins that I have committed do not remember my Lord and do not count my iniquities. For you have chosen the publican and the adulteress you have saved and the right hand thief my Lord you have remembered. And me to the sinner, teach me, O oh my master, to offer repentance. For you do not desire the death of a sinner, but rather that he returns, and that his soul may live. Restore us, O oh God, to your salvation, and deal with us according to your goodness. For you are good and merciful, let your compassion speedily come to us. Have compassion upon us, O Lord God our Savior, and have mercy upon us according to your great mercy. Remember those, O Christ our Master, be among us and proclaim and say, My peace I give to you, the peace of my Father, I live with you. O King of peace, grant us your true peace, render unto us your peace, and forgive us our sins, disperse the enemies of the church, and fortify her that she may not be shaken forever. Emmanuel our God is now in our midst with the glory of his Father and the Holy Spirit. May he bless us all and purify our hearts and heal the sicknesses of our souls and bodies. Tenosh ten moko becherestos, nem bekyot en agathos, nem beb nev matho